Hey guys, Prince of Macedon here. I'm going to do a live commentary video for uh, Medieval 2 Total War. And this is a no rules battle, and it's a interesting uh, florin amount. It's 8,000 florins per player. My opponent's name is TSA93. He's commanding Poland. And since I saw him using Poland, I decided to go Russia. With love. So, I definitely have this huge uh, um, advantage right now in terrain. And the balance bar actually likes me, but... Knowing my Medieval 2 prowess, I'm gonna F this up somehow. So, with 8 Southern Florence, I went with a pretty uh, low grade army here. For my, my skirmish force, I have uh, peasant archers. We'll see how crappy these guys do. So, look at my troops while we're waiting. Oh, he's ready. Well, where's he at? He's way over there. Let's go down. So, oh. while we're waiting, let's look at my army. I have uh, four British backsmen. British axemen, sorry. Um, three peasant archers, these guys. He saw them already. Um, one dismounted boyer's son. Sorry, two dismounted boyer's sons, these guys. What up, son? Four of these Tsar guards and one general's bodyguard. That's my army. Let's go look at the uh, Polish army here. It's got a pretty good cav force. Five units of cav, so same with me. What kind of cav though? Those are cool looking. Um, well, what is this unit? He might have six units of cav. No, five units of cav. He has an artillery piece. Ah, oh, I should have bought artillery. I was thinking about bringing a catapult. So I need to close the distance hardcore. He's a lot of arquebus units, the gunpowder units. So I need to close the distance. He has no reason to close the distance. I do. Put my guys in loose. No, loose. If I can close the distance, I already won half the battle. Did I say good luck, have fun? I forgot. But, um, yeah, with these artillery pieces like this, that's, I'm, I'm guessing, like, 400, 500 florins. And in a 8,000 florin battle, that should be costly, but we'll see. I hope it is. Those spears could be uh, pretty crazy, so even if I beat his calves, I'll have to contend with them. But that's why I brought these... Uh, some of these uh, better... Uh, what do you call them? Foot units here. In the event. Good thing is I'm not, I'm not being shot at yet. I want to scatter my guys just a little bit better. Are these his arquebus units? I'm assuming they are. No. Where do you put his gunpowder units? Handgunners. Yeah. I can do everything by power to not fight them just yet. I mean, not get in their uh, line of sight, line of fire. Just gotta keep my guys moving here. I'm being shot now. I hear it. We are under attack. Oh, now I'm getting hit. Hard. Spearman. 
Those spears are going to get hacked by my dudes, though. I know that for a fact. If we get into close combat. I need to keep his cab away from mine, though. Those handgunners are not in the best position, to be honest. Alright, let's put my guys into a tight formation here. So I'm, I'm whacking his archers right now. He's gonna come at me though. Should I come back to help my infantry? Let's do it. Before I die. A lot of his cav is uh, hussars who are light cav. So I don't even need to confront them. I gotta just destroy them. Let's send these guys to take out these. No, no, no. They're spears. I'll ignore them for now. We're gonna take these dudes out. Light cav. Yeah, my guys are just hacking them down. My my British axemen. So I can just ignore his uh, his skirmishers for now. Oh wait, where's that gun at? I heard it. Where is it? I feel like I'm blind right now. Where is that artillery piece at? I don't know. Whatever. So in a stand-up fight, my guys are gonna hack these dudes down. Why can't I see his his artillery? Oh my gosh, whatever. So these peasant archers are going to go down hardcore. Force oh, there it is, there it is, I see it. I'm gonna go right for those guys. Causing me so much grief. Let's watch his glorious charge. Nice. We have slain the serpent. Time. Just gonna peel off some guys to take out these peasant archers over here. Where are this? Are there any handgunners left? I don't see any more. I wanted some close-ups of me killing some handgunners. I don't see any though. He still has some cab though. Oh wait, right there. There we go. Let's say two of these guys to take him out. So right now they're getting some pretty good shots on me, but once I get into close quarters with them, it's over. I think. Why aren't they moving? Go guys! So my calves should have a field day with these dudes. I know it's his light calves going around, but I'm doing live commentary. He hit these, uh, Hussars. He's got his Hussars, I have my Zars. Alright, let's go watch this. These handgunners are holding their ground, actually. They might need to throw, throw in more cab, let's do it. Get 
Come on, guys, kill him. I expected these guys to fold, but they seem to be well armored. I mean, for a, you know, a skirmish unit, that's a lot of armor. And they have swords, too, so. Alright, so yeah, I was I was watching these close-ups, so I was able to watch the big picture here. Yeah, but you guys like close up, so I'm gonna let you see him. Peasants! Hey, my guys are really disappointing me. Let's chase him off the field. What are these? Spearmen? 15 spears here. Well, since they're surrounded and there's so few of them, that the spears won't do so well against my cav. Alright, these guys are resisting now. I mean, not resisting, but they're running away. But that's all they can do now. Good for my skirmishers. Only thing you can target. But now my cab's here. All civilized peoples will so some sweet action. By the victory we have won here today. We have won here. Alright, so, those are the results. Uh, good game to TSI93. Hope you guys enjoyed this live commentary for Medieval 2.